it's coffee time. Based on a tweet earlier, some of you might have thought that this was going to be sugar-free Red Bull time, but nay, sirs and madams, it is not. I'm really disappointed in myself that I find those tasty now because I have always hated energy drinks. Like, I just, I don't like them. I don't like the smell of them. Like, when somebody drinks a lot of them and their car smells like it, uh, it's hard for me to be in that car, man. But while I was at Lone Star Clash, they didn't have coffee, and I was falling asleep hella. So I had a Red Bull. It's like, I used to hate these. Why does this taste kind of good? But now everybody's all concerned. Anytime I'm like, yeah, I, th I think Red Bull's like kind of okay. Everybody gets really serious with me. Like, don't drink too many of those. Don't ever drink more than one in a day. And I'm like, I have I drank one while I was at Lone Star and one today. <laughs> That's the extent of my Red Bull addiction that everybody apparently thinks I have now. Um, so yeah, coffee is still my true love. Don't even worry about it, guys. Oh my gosh, speaking of StarCraft, the Blizzard World Championships are going on right now. And I turned on the stream while I was like editing and doing all my other stuff, like working on my spreadsheets, whatever. While I was doing all that, I had on this monitor, Blizzard World Championships going on, only watching StarCraft. And it was literally, any time I like glanced over, I would start laughing because something was always going wrong. Something was always going horrendously wrong and not in terms of the gameplay. It was like, it's one of those scenarios. I don't want to like bash on it too hard, but it's a little, it's a little ridiculous. Like so many of us tonight have been like, what is happening in China right now? Because it's one of those scenarios where you feel really bad for the commentators and really bad for the players because you're like, you guys are working so hard and nothing but technical issues have been happening. Like the audio keeps freaking out and then the casters are never muted, never. So like <laughs> there were a couple times where they like cut to commercial and then the camera just stayed on them and they were like, eh. And commercial, and then it's like switched to a cutscene, but the cutscene was muted and the casters were not muted, so they were just like talking about stuff, and sometimes they were like ticked off about things, and like, like oh my gosh, I was like, this is so awkward, but I can't stop watching. Like, it was like the most perfect train wreck because TB threatened to go to sleep so many times tonight. <laughs> He was like, I'm done with this. I'm going to go to sleep. Hopefully tomorrow they'll fix everything. But then like a few minutes later, he would tweet again because he was still watching. It was one of those scenarios where like, I can't, I can't turn this off. <laughs> like I need this to still be on. Like what's going to happen next? I need to know. The games themselves were like fun to watch, but I was so distracted by, oh my God, so many, so many things are happening. I'm just like, oh no. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah. I don't know how, uh, World of Warcraft one is going. I have no idea. I haven't tuned into that at all. I've only watched StarCraft, so. Um, but speaking of World of Warcraft, I started, I was just, like, sitting and, uh, chatting with my cousin, Tyranny, and she, uh, <laughs> she and I were, like, chatting, and she was streaming, her raid, her, that she was doing, and, um, I tuned in, and her, I don't watch people raid, ever. The UI looked so crazy to me, I was like, what is happening? This looks insane. And then I tweeted about it, I felt bad because a million people came in and they were like, this, Dodger, this isn't that crazy. I was like, whoa, it looks so crazy to me. But, uh, yeah, she's, she's kind of a baller. That's all. And it was so funny because, like, sometimes I think people get so used to each other, especially in a family sense, where they don't realize anymore that their mannerisms are the same or that they look alike, really. Like, nobody ever tells us that we look alike anymore. Like, maybe when we were younger, yeah. But when some of you guys came into her, 
came into her Twitch and be like, oh, you guys look a lot alike. And I was like, do we? I can't even remember. Do we? <laughs> you know? Um, we definitely have similar mannerisms. I would never, ever deny that. But she's far more of a baller than I am. She, keep, she keeps her cool <laughs> easier than I do. Those of you who've watched me play games, you know, I don't keep my cool very well sometimes. She keeps her cool for the most part. Um, I admire that. I admire that about her. I'll link you guys to her YouTube. She, uh, she does some cool stuff. She, um, she has a video. This was a long time ago, but I know that some of you guys were wanting to see me put together my computer and I never put that up. Um, but she filmed herself putting together her computer. If you were ever interested in watching somebody do that. Uh, and that was a cool video, but yeah, she does a lot of like, wow stuff and it's fun. I like, I like, I like watching her raid. <laughs> I never watch people raid, but I get like entranced watching her raid. So I'm just like, oh, look at all the sparkly thingies and look at all the levers and what's all this. I don't even, I like, I don't even understand what's going on in them, but I'm like, things are exploding. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. But, um, yeah, today we just built Ikea stuff. We, I mean, I just, I don't have a bed frame. Uh, I didn't have time to go get slats. Rose wardrobe took so long to make. We even had Davis, Warp Zone Davis came over and helped us put it together. And he was raging so hard. I felt useful though, because like, like I left to make my video and all that sort of stuff. So I wasn't helping the entire time. But there were a few times where they were like, can you, we've been building this for too long. Can you come here and see if you can figure out what this instruction means because you know and i in ikea pamphlets typically they don't have any words they're just like picture 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 you're like oh i think they want me to do this so there were a few times where they were like what does this what is this trying to tell us I'm like oh you poor things um so i turned on some family guy for them and helped out where i could ro also got a, a new desk and the desk is pretty awesome. Although I guess the the drawer is like so shallow that she can't even fit very many things in there. So she's like, but she has lots of shelves now and more like actual desk space. So I'm like, I feel like it kind of evens out maybe. I don't know, <laughs> but I'll be excited to get my bed built. Built my, uh, my, um, filing cabinet. That was awesome. If you ever get a filing cabinet, it's uh, called Eric, I think. If you ever get a filing cabinet at Ikea, they snap together so easily. I was like, what? Because it's a really heavy box because it's all metal. But then I took it all out and it was like, snap, 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 snap. Oh, I have a filing cabinet. It was so quick. Blew my mind. Easy. Um, I think that stuff like that, like the, the easy assemble sort of thing gets even easier and easier the more that you build that sort of stuff. Like that and that, those are both like easy assemble things, not from Ikea, but there's, I don't know, like they all have similar methods. So you're just like, oh, okay, dowel, screwy thingy, push together, locker, blah, 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 you know? And, uh, yeah, the more that we do this stuff, the more that I'm like, oh, you just need to do this, this, and this, and this, and oh, look, you have a house. <sighs> I'm, trying, I'm imagining, like, Ikea sending you a boxed house. I'm like, oh, these instructions are a little vague, but I think we can get it. <laughs> Somebody asked me today, if you could have a, life su a lifetime supply of anything, what would it be? And I was like, houses and he just laughed at me because he asked the question and then he answered for himself he was like i think if it was me it would be champagne i want a lifetime supply of champagne and then i was like i just what about a lifetime supply of houses it's like well what if you just had the one house and i was like well anytime the house that i was in got hurt in any way Whoever was supplying my lifetime supply of houses, I would be like, um, I need a new house. And then the other one 
could go to a family in need. So I would just make sure that something tiny broke, you know, every year or so. I'd get to move to all these different houses, and then families could move into my homes. And I'd be like, don't worry about it. Just live there. No mortgage. Don't have to pay for it. It's whatever. I have a lifetime supply of these things. It'd be great. That's, that's what I would do. Lifetime supply of houses. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> I'm tired. I think that Ro just like passed out. She definitely passed out on the couch like when we were done with the wardrobe. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go. I hope that you guys had a good day. <gasps> and it's the weekend. Yes, 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 yes. So I'll talk to you guys again tomorrow. Bye-bye.